Jonah is, I mean, you are a guy who has been looking at the progressive movement for a very long time. Your book, Liberal Fascism, and please, America, read this book. It's fantastic. Uh, especially liberals read it. I mean, you should know that there have been people that have been orchestrating stuff for a very long time. That's why I ask you, is this part of some grand design? I, I don't know if you know the name uh, Ezra Taft Benson, but he was the Secretary of Agriculture um, back in the 1950s under Eisenhower. Eisenhower. Yeah. Yeah. He said, he met with Khrushchev, and he came back and he said, Khrushchev told me, he said, you Americans are so stupid and arrogant. You think you're going to win. Your grandchildren will live under communist rule. And Ezra Taft Benson said, you're crazy. That will never happen. You don't know America. We'll fight you to the last man. And he said, we're just going to feed you socialism, dribs and drabs, until one day you wake up and you're living under our rule. He said it would happen by the time he said, uh, Mr. Benson, your um, uh, your grandchildren will live under that system. I'm having dinner with his grandchildren this Saturday. <laughs> Look where we are. I mean, is that just a coincidence? Well, I mean, look, I mean, I can't, you know, the, the Khrushchev and those guys, they were talking in the context of we will bury you, Soviet rule and all of that. I do think it's indisputable that we are moving towards socialism. The cover of Newsweek celebrates that we're all socialists now. We're nationalizing the banks. We're capping CEO pay. You know, th that is the direction that we're in. And I, I think that's absolutely true. You know, and Arthur Schlesinger, you know, the great dean of, of liberal historians, said that we can have socialism in this country through a series of new deals. And... I'm not saying that we're going to be socialist tomorrow once Obama signs this stimulus bill, but he's put a nice down payment on it. We are definitely moving in that direction. 